Hey, the bugs is Ross going back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed and doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my growing, beautiful extended family, thank you so much for support. Our channel is growing a lot in the last few days and which is such a blessing to be able to do. You're dropping down these beautiful comments, which pulls on my heartstrings a lot like I tell y'all you know I'm so sensitive but it just feels really good that I'm able to put out videos to help people um through really dark times having them see the things that you know they're trying to decipher on uh, what is the signs in their life or whatever but I'm glad I'm able to do that for others it's truly a blessing so with that being said much love to all namaste love and blessings love and light and many blessings are definitely coming your way and if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already please like and subscribe even hit that notification bell so you know when I'm about to upload my next video if you feel comfortable enough, please drop me a line or two. I love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. Even if it's about the positive feedback of the content of my video, or you're just up, tell me about your empathic gift and how it impacted your life and heading you towards a positive direction. Also, if you feel like the video is giving you good inform uh, information and gave you good vibes as well, and you want to share with a loved one, family, or friend, or even a fellow empath that is going, you know, through some trying times right now and need confirmation and validation please go ahead and share also give me a thumbs up like and also share on your social media favorites wherever you see fit and once again thank you so much for stopping by my channel and showing me so much love and support is greatly appreciated and i hope that uh you're able to resonate with the content of my video today let me see turn it up a little bit so you can hear it um it's called activate your super uh, my meditation video today is activate your super intelligence genius brain power frequency and binary beats and i will post that link in the description box below you know we all need that you know our brains are just going automatic like overload so we need something to boost up you know those brain waves so in case you need to use that go ahead and you know go into the link and today my video is about twin flame 101 the uh hey Oka's, the emotions we are feeling are releasing uh releasing is helping get rid of old patterns it is it's like since we've been going through these shifts and stuff like that um i've been very overwhelmed with emotions it's like it makes me feel like i'm going crazy i'll be laughing one minute and then next thing you know it makes me think of a thought and have me really crying the next and you know it's just like i'm hearing you know my grandmother my grandfather my mom my dad everybody just talking to me and giving me so much support so it's like if you're going through these different situations it makes you feel like you're just straight schizo or you know bipolar or whatever even though i was labeled as these things growing up with mental health um it's just basically universe having you um just everything's coming to the surface it's like you know like when you're putting cleanser on your face or that stuff that you know exfoliate or whatever and it's bringing everything out your pores to be able to you know clear your pores out and get all the blackness and the toxic things that we carry on our face that's basically how uh you know we keep our memories and we keep our past trauma uh closed up there's like you you, you deal with a lot of stuff especially from your past probably your childhood that has really traumatized you in the worst kind of way and you're trying to find the best way to heal trying to let go you're just trying to find all the answers but it just seems like when you're trying to do it on your own you know it's uh let me see it gets kind of hard because it's like you get frustrated with yourself and you know you don't want to feel these feelings anymore you know you want to be able to heal and let go and move on but at times when you have you know received some really bad trauma or dark times in your life you have a bad habit of when things get stressful things get dark or we get frustrated all these unwanted feelings come up and it's like since we're going through these shifts and everything and we have something coming forth for us and many different blessings we can't be having these things in our hearts 
So they're having us resurface everything. Everything's coming up like past vomit. You know, like if you burp and, you know, it's really gross when you burp and then you feel that, that, that juice or whatever that is come up. You're like, ugh, that tastes so bad. That's basically, you know, just like, a, you know, a memory. It doesn't taste good. It doesn't feel good. It, you know, you could be in a good mood and next thing you know, it's just a certain thing will trigger it off. So it's just like you're going through these waves of emotions and, um, you really feel like I, I can't deal with it as being unbearable. It's like I told y'all this was the day before yesterday, but you received a video yesterday. It's like our energies are being recycled. Our memories is starting to be resurfaced. It's just like if you go if you see one of them things that recycle stuff, you might be able to, you know, like if if you put water in a water filter or whatever and it's just filtering out everything so it can come back to you nice and clean that's basically what it's doing but it's like with all the, the empaths in the world a lot of empaths in the world there's millions and mil millions of us with all these different fre frequencies it is folded up the different dimensions out in the galaxy and it's really crazy because it, it's just like it's messing with your equilibrium you might be you know insomnia you know uh, uh, your eating habits everything is changing but everything is coming to the surface so don't feel like you're you're dwelling on stuff there you're not dwelling on it you know even though sometimes you know it just depends if you're currently going through stuff you know we tend to get upset about things that's our human reaction it's like a a, 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 a counter way to you know uh, i forgot the word i'm trying to use <laughs> but it is a fail safe that's what i meant to say it's like a fail safe is we go through things or whatever and especially if you're currently experiencing things it might make you you know think about it a little bit and it can be overwhelming but they're needing you to face those um being able to let go because they have beautiful things coming towards you so they're making you face all these things head on and very intense to where it could come out in your dreams and it's like your dreams are like very scary you know and it's just like i had a dream that i have a, a loved one close to me like sliced their wrist in front of me and i kept on seeing them pick it open i'm like oh my god what are you doing and i'm like what kind of dream is this why would i dream about somebody slicing their wrist and they got a big hole in it and it was just like you know dealing with all these different things and life was, is just being crazy but it's just like when you know you have blessings coming towards your way they need you to not have that hate in your heart not have sadness in your heart um even though they know it's hard times and they do sympathize with you but they that's the reason why they're making you face these things right now so the beautiful vibes and beautiful blessings uh, have that room for it to be able to flow into you so if you're feeling like everything is starting to resurface and you're just trying to understand why I keep thinking about these things why do I have to keep going through this they're making you face these things so you can be able to part ways with them, make peace with yourself being able to forgive yourself heal yourself the way you're supposed to be because you know um, you're a beautiful soul you're a beautiful person so they want you to be able to have the finer things in life being able to have the beautiful blessings that you deserve to come in but if we are holding so much darkness in our heart and sadness in our heart we won't be able to enjoy those things because we're repelling them so if they if you have any of these things that are going on right now like I'm struggling with you know it's just like I got 14 days left until my dad's anniversary so that's holding really hard on my heart right now so dealing with these things is you know they're making us face a lot of things that we don't want to face anymore and um, just basically wanting us to heal so if you're going through these times and I sound like I hate it when I cry but if you're going through these things right now um, knowing you are healed from these things you'll be able to let them go um, but they're making you face them because you deserve better in your life so going through these emotions they're making you go through them because you truly deserve happiness in your life you need that light to be able to flow through you and I hear it all the time it's just like when I think of my dad I get really emotional especially since it's so time so close for his anniversary so I get really sensitive but I hope you are able to um, relate to this video resonate just know days are coming there are gonna be better but we're gonna be dealing with a lot of shifts we're gonna deal with a lot of release and a lot of upgrades and downloads. I'm just like, enough is enough. 
but you have to go th through these things and know that um, better days are coming. You know, I know we, we all get tired of hearing, you know, you're trying to be patient, you're trying to push out positivity, but it just seems like the yes comes at you all different directions. And you, we have to constantly remember when we know bad things are coming at us, obviously the devil is like trying to work hard to make sure you don't get your blessings because they know what God has planned for you and they don't want those things to happen for you so they're going to bring things up to you that is like really going to mess you up mentally and emotionally so be prepared for that but while you're at it release those things because it's like it's no longer we, we need to be able to pull the emotions out of that trauma out of that traumatic memory and know that you know better days are coming so it's like they're they're having us go through these things so we don't have the same negative thought process uh, being able to respond to things in a certain light being able to when when memories come up to be able to not allow them to affect you in the way that they always have before so okay y'all I'm still getting emotional so I'm gonna go ahead and cut this short and um, I hope you were able to resonate. I'm going to give me a post notification shout out to Spirit Girl. Much love to you. Thank you for subscribing with expect, uh, expectancy. I don't know why my tongue is getting tired right now. So much love to you as well. Sending much love and many blessings to you. I hope you had a blessed, safe Sunday and a safe one at that. Send out as much love and light and positivity as you possibly can. Know that you are truly blessed, highly favored, and forever loved. And knowing there's always somebody out there praying for your better days. I pray for y'all each and every day. And the love that you're giving me, I'm sending it right back. So like and subscribe. Even hit that notification bell. Drop me a line. Even hit the notification bell so you know I'm about to upload my next video and, you know, drop me a line and let me know how you feel about this. Have you been going through these things? Have you been struggling with dark times of your past trauma? Um, have you been experiencing the shift as well, you know, of gratitude and positive vibes towards your way? So I will see you in my next video. I, I said I just got to just calm myself down so I know the better days are coming. So I love y'all and I will see you on my next video. Much love, peace, and be wild.